Good morning, everybody. <laughs> Welcome back to the Thailand Lofts. We are currently in Koh Samui. Our first full day here. We are getting breakfast in the hotel. We're staying at the Brisa Beach Resort uh, on Chiang mm -hmm. Beach. Um, I've got some pineapple and some pad thai. Bit of a random mixture and some orange juice. I'm gonna try this one out. Today we are going to Pig Island and some other island. I'm already sure we're getting back to it in like 10 minutes, so we need to eat up. Um, so yeah, I hope you're enjoying the vlogs and I hope you enjoy this one. <laughs> Pig Island. We actually had a little pit stop and did a bit of snorkeling. And I would have, you already would have seen that footage pretty bad, but I got it's something amazing. this time, so I'm I happy. It in slow -mo. Yeah, oh. which was really bad. And we've now made it to Pig Island. It is absolutely gorgeous here. I'm actually really liking it. The water is so blue. And there's kayaks, so we are going to do some kayaking. And we already have found some pigs. I think some of the pigs have died from swine flu. We have heard. But there is some. Oh, hi, little piggy. They are so cute. They look a bit tired. I mean, there's more over here that are living life. Hey, piggy, piggy. They probably never need to be fed. Yeah, no, definitely not. What are they eating the sand for, though? Ooh. Hello, piggy. Wink, wink. <laughs> hey, piggy, piggy. Oh, you're funny. You feel funny. They don't mind you petting them, which I'm surprised about. Oh, they're running away. This is so funny. Oh, bro, your friends are leaving you. This is so cute. I'm really enjoying this. Yeah. We now have three hours to chill on this island. We can get the high kayaks I think we're going to do. We can snorkel. And then we have lunch at 12. So, yeah, Yummy. pretty fun. <laughs> Look, I got a slot gibbet to match Ronin's. This tour cost us 52 euro each, um, and it's for like a seven hour thing to be honest. We got to do snorkeling at one spot, now we're here at Pig Island for three hours. We get lunch included, hotel pickup and drop off, um, kayaks included, snorkeling equipment everything like that so I think it's a pretty good price these trips are really good because we get breakfast in the hotel in all of our hotels we've got breakfast included because it's just so much easier then we get lunch here so we're not spending a lot of money we're really only spending like for dinner when we get home uh, and like no taxis no nothing so they're cheap days when you do these because you've already paid for them in advance so would recommend <laughs> Or falling in the water. Okay. I know it's a bit harder. Okay, we've just got some food. I think this is fr yeah, rice, um, some fruit, tom yum soup. This is actually really popular. We haven't tried it yet though, so there we go. I think sweet this is like sour. sweet and sour chicken and some wings. chicken wings. So this looks good, I'm not gonna lie, like this is a lot of food. You can have the rest of this soup. Mm. And the rest of the soup. Thank you. Tom yum soup. So good. Basically, just tastes like bread curry sauce. Really, really good. One thing I've noticed is that they don't use chopsticks over here. I, did, I thought they would, but I haven't seen anyone use them. Maybe they're not popular over here. I thought they would be, but they're not. This food is really good, though. We are leaving now. I think in like a couple minutes, our boat is over there. I really enjoy this island. She's one with one. nature here. I am one Pig with nature. And I got this top on. How nice is this? So cute. My skirt is so wet from kayaking. Because Ronnie keeps splashing me. We've just come back <laughs> to Koh Samui. It's only like a 10 minute boat ride. So we've got back and we have to get like an hour bus home now. To the, to the hotel. And then we're going to get ready for dinner and go somewhere for dinner. I don't know where, but somewhere. Ronnie got this jersey the other day. Let me show you. Oh, wow. Wow. Rip, rip Kobe. Yeah, rip. Oh. <laughs> hey guys, I'm eating seafood. Got a margarita because I'm boring. It's a very fancy restaurant, I'm not gonna lie. They're really nice though. Got a cosmopolitan and has a pina colada. 
Yomi was expensive though. We have left the restaurant and we're currently trying to find somewhere for cocktails. We found one place back there which was 100 baht per cocktail, which is like 270, which is so cheap. Um, so everyone keeps me safe. I'm really bad on roads. I just walk everywhere. But it's quite bopping tonight. I thought it was going to be a bit dead, but there's music playing from absolutely everywhere. Yeah. Some oh, I'm going to walk into something. We had one cocktail at one other place and it was 100 baht, which is like 270, so cheap. Wasn't that good though and it was really small, so we left. And we've come to this place, which is way more vibey, and we got some buckets. I got a tequila sunrise bucket, which was 350 baht, uh, which is pretty good. Like, it's huge and it, there's a lot of cocktail in it. Like, it's cocktail, it's not like a vodka and coke or anything. Ronan got a Singapore sling. Yeah. yeah, it's nearly finished. It's really good. It is really good. And there's a club over there, so we can like get some of the music, but we can still like talk to each other. <laughs> it's really vibey, so we're gonna go out one of the nights I have. I'm gonna take out one of my going out nightclub dresses. It's gonna be good. I can't really go to a nightclub in a long dress, so yeah. We're enjoying it though, it's really yummy. Yupa. The language barrier over here is not that bad. Like a lot of the Thai people speak a little bit of English so you can communicate, it's not that hard. People say it's really hard, it's really not that hard. I don't think I finished yesterday's vlog off, uh, but you saw we had some drinks and then I forgot to end the vlog. But I, was, I don't need to end the vlog because I think today is just gonna be part of yesterday's vlog too. So uh, I'm currently in our pool, we have our own pool really nice it's like a plunge pool which means it's like really cold and it's like 34 degrees right now it says on apple that it feels like 41 with the humidity so it's very hot right now uh we also had a situation this morning ronan blocked the toilet so um it wasn't to, me it, it literally was like, he was literally woke me. me up going the toilet's blocked so we <laughs> had to call reception and they fixed it for us so we're all good now but a lot of places here you can't flush toilet paper down the toilet which is sort of weird and we so, did that and we did do that by accident so that's probably why it happened but we're gonna go to the jungle club for dinner tonight we think which is like one of the most famous places here uh it's like up at the very top of a cliff today we're gonna chill maybe go to the beach yeah chilling in the pool right now though it's really really nice and i feel sort of fancy and bougie with our own pool um, yeah, that's pretty much an update right now. Now we are walking around. There's like a shopping center in Koh Samui. It literally, literally looks like I'm in like America or something. It's called Central Festival or Central Samui. But there's so many shops. There's a Crocs shop up there, Skechers. But they have all like the Thailand clothes brands and everything. So yeah, it's sort of cool. And today we're just having a chill day to be honest because we're so exhausted. We've been moving around a lot the past couple of days. So uh, we bought two pandas. Absolutely no idea where we're gonna put them in our bags absolutely no idea but that's a later day problem <laughs> i have no idea where we're gonna put them i think we're gonna have to carry them onto the planes or, and stuff we can't carry them onto ferries ronan that is so embarrassing <laughs> like we actually can't do that i have no clue where we're gonna put these i don't ask me i don't know we're all ready for dinner fancy dressed up tonight and um, we have just booked a taxi with the hotel to take us to the jungle club it is one of the most like renowned places, um, restaurants in uh, Chuang. It's literally in the jungle, like in the Chuang Noi jungle at the top of a cliff. So you have to get a taxi to the bottom of the cliff and then you have to call the restaurant and they send in a shuttle and collect you. I don't know how much this taxi is gonna cost. It's gonna be quite expensive because it's quite far away, but we're gonna pay it anyway because it's meant to be really amazing. So, and if you're gonna come to Smoothie, you sort of have to go to this restaurant and it's meant to be amazing. <laughs> I will show you more in a minute, but we are very lucky to have gotten a seat like by the view because we came and we didn't have a reservation. I didn't know you can make a reservation. So they wanted to give us a seat like far up where you couldn't really see the view. But I was like, oh, like, do you not have any other seats? So they, we got this seat. We're all sitting in bean bags. Like, it's actually so funny. Like, are you kidding? Are you kidding? We got some drinks. I got a sex on the beach and Ronan got a Negroni. And what you get for dinner, Ro? I got a uh, Tom. Tom yum soup. Yum soup and a mastermind curry. Yum. With rice. I got spring rolls to start and a Diablo pizza. It's like a spicy pizza for my main. So we are treating ourselves tonight. It's not probably not going to be in the budget, but we're going to treat ourselves. The taxi man up here was lovely and he's, in a, he's arranged to pick us up in two and a half hours, which is just great. And he didn't take any money off us, 
for the first trip he just said he'll give the money for both trips at the end which is so trustworthy and Thai people are just so nice and they trust everyone which is crazy obviously we're gonna be there and we'll pay him but and we'll tip him well yeah. because he really got us up this mountain I don't know how else he would have got up here because we don't have so it was crazy steep so we didn't have to get the shuttle that I was talking about because you can get up the mountain if you have a 4x4 vehicle like a, what's it called a 4 Four, four, by four. four by four. So his car was a four by four, so he could get us up the mountain, um, which was crazy. But we're here, and I'm so happy. We came here for the sun setting. I timed it very well. Not gonna lie, so the sun is setting right behind us. This is beautiful. Ronan, how is your Negroni? It's amazing. Okay, so our food has just arrived. I don't think they really do starters and mains over here. They just <laughs> give you everything at once. We experienced that at lunchtime as well. So here's my pizza, spring rolls. We have a lot of food here. Oh, this is a lot of food, but I'm very excited. Good, Ronan? Really good. It's very difficult to eat here because the table is very low. <laughs> mm, so good though. We got two jungle juices. The sun has set. It's a really good night for it. I'm not gonna lie. We got a very, very good night. And the fan is keeping us very cool. And I move seats, so I'm closer to Ronan. 